The BMPT Terminator refers to an armored fighting vehicle, AFV, designed and manufactured by the Russian company. This vehicle was designed for supporting tanks and other AFVs in urban areas. It was unofficially named the Terminator by the manufacturers. This Terminator, or the boy via Machina, Podersky Tankov, BMPT, is based on the widely used T-72 main combat tank design. It was developed using battle experience from the Soviet-Afghan War and the First Chechen War. Prior to the development of the present BMPT, several prototypes of a tank support combat vehicle were constructed. The Object 199 Ramka was the prototype for the current BMPT, with Ralva Gonzavod as the official manufacturer. Beginning in 2005, a small number were delivered to the Russian ground forces for evaluation. The Terminator was finally ordered by the Russian Defense Ministry in August 2017, while in early 2018, deliveries of more than 10 vehicles started. Followed by December 1, 2021, the Russian Federation's armed forces deployed the first BMPT company of nine combat vehicles into one of the tank regiments of the Central Military District's tank division. The version, unofficially dubbed the Terminator 3, incorporates the chassis, hulls, and components of the T-14 Armada tank. The history of the BMPT's development can be traced back to the Soviet war in Afghanistan. Combat experience during the lengthy war revealed that infantry fighting vehicles like the BMP-1 and BMP-2 cannot fully cope with manpower, despite the latter having a high gun elevation. Although main battle tanks possessed a high amount of firepower, the limited elevation and depression of the main gun made them easy targets in mountainous and urban terrain. Talking about the mission it goes through when used in urban terrain, each main battle tank is deployed with two beam PTs. Outside of urban warfare, that ratio is reversed with one beam PT protecting two main battle tanks. This results from the complexity of fighting in urban terrain and the need for a versatile anti-personnel platform that can engage multiple targets at once and on different height levels. The deployment of such a vehicle reduces the stress of urban fighting for MBTs and can relieve them of some of the workload, allowing them to focus on their primary mission of targeting other MBTs and hardened targets. When talking about its armaments, this Terminator is equipped with four Ataka anti-tank guided missile launchers as a set of primary armaments against enemy tanks and infantry. Only one missile is carried for each of the launchers without any additional ones stowed away. Two anti-tank guided missile launchers are located on each side of the turret and traverse a complete 360 degrees in sync with the turret. This tank also has an additional set of primary armaments consisting of two 30mm II of 42 autocannons. A total of 850 rounds of ready-use ammunition can be carried. These twin autocannons have a combined fire rate of 600 rounds per minute. This vehicle is also fitted with a fire control system. A computerized fire control system is installed to allow the BMPT to attack targets in both day and night settings, and while the BMP is stationary or moving. The sight of the gunner includes a thermal channel, an optical channel, a guided anti-tank guided missile channel, and a laser rangefinder. The field of view sight has an independent stabilization in two planes. The sites provide detection of targets at ranges up to 7,000 meters in inclement weather conditions. The protection of the BMPT is superior to most MBTs, as active and passive protection is used and additional armor, the vehicle lacks a turret, is distributed to the hull of the vehicle. The BMPT is fitted with additional ERA on the front and sides. The side skirts are equipped with dynamical protection and latticed screens, which provides protection against RPGs. According to the characteristics of protection boards, the BMPT outperforms the T-90 tank. Unlike the T-90, protection from anti-tank weapons are also provided towards the sides and the rear of the vehicle. 
Considering other features mounted in this tank, the Terminator's latest upgrade is equipped with fragmenting ammunition, which is essential to target the enemy infantry, which lies in wait to destroy the tanks. Information in public domain also reveals that increased gun elevation provides for engaging top fours of buildings in urban environments, and also low-flying aircraft or drones. The manufacturer claims that a single Terminator can replace two conventional BMPs and an infantry platoon. The Terminator has a crew of five consisting of a vehicle commander, a driver, a gunner, and two grenade launcher operators. NBC protection is provided to the crew to ensure survival against radiation, chemical, and biological weapons. As an option, the Beanham PT can be fitted with mine clearing devices such as the KMT 7 or KMT 8 mine sweepers. Regarding its operational sites, Western military analysts believe that Russia developed the Terminator after identifying the need to provide dedicated protection to main battle tanks it used during the Afghan and the Chechen Wars. The tank support vehicles are designed to protect the Russian tanks against enemy infantry. They are basically a replacement for mechanized infantry troops in the urban battlefield. The high level of attrition suffered by the Russian tanks in the ongoing war in Ukraine due to the use of anti-tank weapons provided by the West appears to have pushed Russian military commanders to induct the Terminator. The move is aimed at providing close protection to the Russian armor from Ukrainian tank hunting infantry. According to the latest intelligence bulletin released by the British Ministry of Defense on the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, Russia's BMPT Terminator tank support vehicles have likely been sent to the Severodonetsk axis of the Donbas offensive. According to the British appreciation of intelligence inputs and several independent sightings of the Terminators, their presence suggests that the Central Grouping of Forces CGF, is involved in this attack, which is the only Russian army formation fielding this vehicle. For the updates, it is unknown how many Terminators Russia presently has in service. However, in late 2021, Russia added 10 to a tank regiment of its central military district. Some Western analysts mentioned that the deployment of several of the rare fighting vehicles is a sign of frustration from the Kremlin, while Russian commentators have praised their use as an example of the depth of Russia's arsenal. In any case, the presence of Terminators in the Donbass, where advanced anti-tank weaponry awaits the Russian advance, is certainly a gamble. The Russian military's carefully crafted image of invincibility would take a further beating if the Terminators fare poorly in Ukraine. That's all for today. If you know further details about this Terminator, feel free to drop your comments below. And the most important one, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more updates on awesome videos. Thanks for watching and see you next time.